Hello everybody, my name is Stephen Quick and this video is me giving you a tour of my beautiful shiny new website which is spectacular, spectacular, the words in the vernacular. You will enjoy it, you will love it. Uh, the website took me a long bloody time to build. It nearly killed me, it nearly made these fingers fall off, it nearly made me blind, but it was done. So this video I'm going to give you the tour and show you how to use it, show you the differences from the old website and most of all make you visit it. And once you've visited it you will be happy, 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 happy. So let's have a look at the new website. Splinterstudios.com, the art of Stephen Quick. That's me. I'm not going to use screen capture, I'm just going to film like this. So first of all, open up your browser. The site works best on Chrome or Firefox. I'm going to view it on Firefox. Um, it, it works fine on most browsers, but if you're using IE, if you're watching this video and you notice in the top corner you've got IE, Internet Explorer, and you're using that, give yourself a slap. Right, first of all we need to go to the website. It's not facebook.com, but it's S P L I N T E R E D studios.com Splinterstudios.com If you ever use my old website, You'll notice there's one big thing lacking on this one that's not on the old one. There's a splash page. The splash page on the old website was only really there because I messed up coding when I did the original site, but that's because I didn't know what I was doing, and I didn't really know what I was doing this time. So this here is the brand new home page, the index page. Along the top we have home. Oh, it lights up. About, galleries, films, commissions, blogs, search, contact. So let's discuss this first page here. These things up here, links to YouTube, to Facebook, to Twitter, to Tumblr, and to sign up for a newsletter. Here we have featured painting at the moment. It's a Deadpool versus Wolverine. And a featured video, which is near was the latest video. Click on that and it'll start playing. There we go. Here, just some blurb. And here is uh, get latest paintings, videos, news sent straight to your inbox. So you can sign up here by putting your email address in there and I will send out a newsletter once a month with all the latest paintings on. And now scrolling down a bit, we have this section, the latest paintings available. So here will be all the latest paintings that I've done and um, also ones that haven't sold yet. So we've got lots and lots and then down a bit more, we have the latest videos, latest speed painting videos. And then down here we have a few more buttons how to buy, postage packaging, collectors, press, feedback links, I'll go through this page in a minute. And then we have here the share things. Just click there to share the page on any of your social media or whatever. And then an advert here, people are very against adverts, which I am too, but uh, this little advert here pays for my hosting per year, so that's fantastic. So let's visit the first page. The first page is about. On all about Stephen Quick. I like to pretend my art has nothing to do with me, Roy Lichtenstein. And here, this is wicked, look at that, a little top trump card of me, which is quite good. Then um, just a blurb about what I do, sort of personal statement, then an artist statement, which is a bit more arty party. Uh, then we have a press release, which is just for press, obviously, and exhibitions, and then some more photographs on my face. Okay, the next page is the most important page, the galleries. So, click on the galleries. Oh, there's my new logo. Uh, new Splinter Studios logo. Uh, the old one just said Splinters and Studios Small. So here's the new one, inspired by True Blood, if you've watched it. Art Steam Quick with my logo, which is the arrow, which I actually left off and showed in my Facebook group, and they said, no, oh, put it back on. So an important page, the galleries page. Let's click on the galleries. You'll be greeted by all the different sub galleries. We have the pop up galleries here, and then the fine art galleries, then the parody and satire, then other bits and bobs. So we have music pop up, film pop up, TV pop up, uh, football pop up, video games, comic book, then the fine art galleries. These are my uh, collections. So we've got showgirls, the nude, some urban landscapes, uh, Kate Moore's gallery on her own, and the farm. Parodies, we have the Bananas, the Eye Manifesto, the Love War, uh, Miscellaneous, and Parodies. And then I've got a sale bit, which is where I put paintings that are on sale. A bit further down, we have information on commissions, which we'll cover in a bit, prints, and merch. So when you click into one of these galleries, so we'll go music first. When you click in that, 
This is what we're greeted with. We're greeted with the gallery. And I've split it up so it's split into bands here. So we have the Bon Jovis, the Foo Fighters, the Jeff Buckleys, uh, the 30 Seconds to Mars, and My Chemical Romance, Mike Patton, him, Tom Waits, blah, 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 blah. There's hundreds of buggers. And within here, you have the painting with a little thumbnail, the title, and if it's commissioned or available. And then when you click on that, you actually go to the painting. I'll cover those pages in a minute. And that is the same for the films. So here's the film gallery and the TV gallery, the comic book gallery, video games, football. So when you go to a gallery, so now I'm in the Showgirls gallery, you see all the paintings and you select a painting. So I'm going to select Jess. So I click on her and then we go to the page that's got this painting on. So on this page, we will, you'll, be, you'll, be presented, you'll be presented with a photograph of the front, the main photo, a side view, uh, details, details of the painting there, and then an in situ photograph, which is nice to have, so that's what it looks like. Uh, below it, there'll be some blab blurb about the painting, so saying what it's about, and it'll say the size, if it's a deep edge, um, and then you'll have here title, size, medium, what have you, and the price. And then these are all the new bits. This is where most of the work comes. So you've got your share thing there, the same again. So if you want to share this painting on Facebook, you do that. Um, it'll log you to Facebook, log into Facebook, and share the painting. Share the page, if you like. Uh, you can print out the painting. Uh, you can email it to a friend, or let you can share them all those ones. Then we have the buying. Before, my website only handled UK postage, but now it handles the whole world. So if you wanted this painting of Jess, you go down here to the buy button, select your shipping. So you've got UK, USA, Canada, EU, Australia. You select the one, so I'm going to ship to Canada, and you click add to cart. And then you're presented with the Splinter Studios PayPal page. So you can make a one-off payment here. If you don't have a PayPal account, just fill in your card details and your address. Or if you do, you just log in. So it'll just log you in. And here is where it's to summarize what it is. So Jess, price 250, and then I'll give the postage. And then you just follow the instructions, really. That's it. Nice and simple. I'm PayPal verified, everything's nice and simple and easy as pie. So that's what you got. You got some more galleries. So you've got the nudes. There you go, that's all the nude paintings. You got the urban landscapes, not many of them. Churches and what have you. Uh, the farm. That's all these cow paintings, which are pretty key. Um, Kate Moss Gallery, the Banana Manifesto, which celebrity, uh, famous photographs, famous poses, posters, people with bananas instead of guns. <laughs> and then we have the Eye Manifesto, which is very much the same, but they have iPods. There you go, they have iPods, so they're all listening to their favorite tunes. Uh, the Love War Gallery, uh, the parodies, which are just various funny things. Miscellaneous, obviously, what doesn't fit into a gallery. Sale, I have no sale on the moment, but if I did have a sale, it would be here. And then scroll down. Commissions will cover later, prints will cover, and I would do prints now. This is the print page. So, prints, there's a few options. There's mounted prints, that's mini. Medium prints that aren't mounted. Large prints, mounted large prints, so you can go extra large ones, which aren't on here at the moment, because it's only certain paints you can do that. And then any runs I have, so at the moment I have Barnstable Tesco's as a, a limited edition run. You can see how much they are, £35, and uh, order it. Uh, with these ones, just drop me an email. Merch is the last one to cover here. Merch at the moment is handled by Spreadshirt, who uh, you may know is an external company. So this is just a little iframe that has all my merch in. So you just got t-shirts, uh, little strappy tops, uh, more t-shirts with a different logo, and then the signature stuff. Uh, some tote bags. So go get them if you want.
Now, the next button we have after galleries is films. When you go into films, you'll be greeted by, again, sub-galleries. We have the speed paintings, we have the real-time art, we have the slideshows, we have the closer looks, the tutorials, and the art house. Um, obviously, when you click inside, you'll be presented with each one of them, but I'll just cover the speed painting one at the moment because that's the biggest gallery. So when you go to the speed painting gallery, you'll be greeted with lots of thumbnails. So here's all the music video speed paintings, here's all the film and TV speed paintings, here's all the video games and comic books, and here's the other. This is all speed painting videos, hundreds of them. On this, there's no direct link to the video at the moment, but it goes to the painting. So if I click on that one there, Iron Maiden, it'll go to the Iron Maiden painting, and then down underneath it, you have the video, and you know, so on, John Bon Jovi. I keep picking the same paintings. And then you just could click there, watch the video, and then you can buy it here. Do, do, let's see me, I'm doing a spin. I think I go JBJ. This is about a year and a half old. J B. J. Bam, bam, but Alex by music by Alex Sadler. <laughs> um, so that's what you got there. You got all the thumbnails to all the different speed paintings. You've got the same here, real time art, uh, same process. You got the real time link, the Ryan Dunn one, the tribute. So there's the Ryan Dunn tribute, and there's the painting. Um, and then you've got the slideshow, slideshow, sorry, which of course makes sense, just um, those paintings which have slideshow presentations. Uh, closer looks, closer looks tutorials, where the tutorials will be, art house, where my old art house films will be. So, the next page, let's go on, this one's very important, commissions. This is if you want to commission a painting. Commission, so this explains how to commission, this is the commission process. I've even made a little video which tells you how to how to order a commission, the whole process you can go through. There you go, that's me having a chat. Um, and then I have examples of styles I do. We've got monochrome, we've got color, sepia, two-tone, splash, splatters. Of course, mixes, mixtures of these is what normally happens, but, and then we've got examples, which helps. So I want to see an example of a mono, we click on the Buffy one. There's an example of the mono style. Uh, full color, slash, there we go. And then if you scroll down a bit more, a bit more blurb, there goes some, something to help for sizing. So there's a door, 6'6", six, six, and we'll just to give you an idea of what sizes are. A bit more blurb. Then we've got my examples of all the personal commissions I've done over the years. Most of them, there's a few I'm not on there. So these are all the personal ones. So these are people, that's a couple, a guy playing a guitar, a family portrait, a guy playing football, a band. So these are people who are not famous and commissioned special paintings. Uh, these are ones you click inside and you get the painting and then you get the painting and what it's made up of. So this one here, you've got the couple here. So we used, um, I switched it around uh, and then we moved the Eiffel Tower and the wheel all into the same photograph. Um, and you can do the same if we find like so that one there. The Gifford family, we use those two photographs and then the daughter and switch their head um, the other way around. And that just sort of, Shows you how it happens, shows you the story. Um, and same, all these all these are personal commissions, so they're all individual. Um, and then down here, we've got an example again, another speed painting of a commission. So it just walks you through it and shows you how I did it. And that's it. So if you want to commission a painting, go to this page, and it will tell you how to do it. And it usually involves dropping me an email. So there you go, drop an email, and we'll go onto the contact page in a minute. And um, we can do whatever we want, which is good fun. Um, but this should help, give you a basis. When you email me, I've got a basis of understanding what, to know what you want to do. Next page is the blog. The blog is just a Tumblr iframe embedded. So the blog has all the news, all the latest paintings, all the latest videos, um, thoughts, um, etc. where you can meet me and so on. Then we have a search which is pretty self-explanatory. You want to search for a painting. Again, if you knew the old site, you will know that this is news. So it, the old site used to open up a whole new page and you'd have all the search results. Here, you type in Buffy, click search, and it pops up, see? So you've got a pop-up with all the Buffy links, and then that will direct you to the page, see? So that's a good, good search thing. That's a very good search engine we've got in there. Um, and I'm very happy with that one. Contact page. Contact form, just for any details, name, email, subject, message. If you can, just help me. Tell me how you found out about me. This really helps. Just telling me how you came across me. And then a bit below, we've got the sign up again to the newsletter. 
So that's all the top pages done. The home page obviously takes you back home. The about page, all about me. The various galleries which has all the paintings in here, over 500 paintings. The films which has all the speed paintings, the real time art, the art house. How to commission a painting laid out in text form and video form and examples and previous work. Uh, the blog which is Tumblr, all the news and bits and bobs. Search to search for a painting and contact contact me. Now the bottom buttons are less entertaining but just as useful. So how to buy. Of course everything I do is via PayPal or check if you're in the UK and this just explains it. It gives you links to um, postage costs um, and just tells you how to do it, how to buy a painting which is pretty simple. Postage and packaging. This covers how expensive postage is to each of these countries. So England, uh, America, Canada, EU, non-EU countries, Australia, and then all about insurance, which is all, all included, multiple items pack, and then just a little example of packing. So you get the painting, which then gets bubble wrapped and foam wrapped, then gets cardboarded, and then gets wrapped in paper, and then gets sent off to you. Collectors, this is a really good page. This page has paintings in their new home. People have sent me photographs when they've bought a painting and um, shown me where they're hanging it. So these are all photos from various years, various customers who have sent me a photograph of their painting in their house, which is very cool. So there's one of uh, Bridget Bardot. That's what it looks like. How good is that? Um, one of the Queen. How good is that? Uh, let's see what we've got. Uh, let's find one that's somewhere else. So this guy sent me a picture as he received the painting. Look at that, it's brilliant. So he's in Australia as so. well. Uh, and then when they got it hung up. Um, and so this is all, you know, just pictures of paintings in their own home, which is really nice for me because I don't get to see them in their new home. I just get to see them in a messy studio. Next page, press. Press is self-explanatory, I guess. It's photographs from exhibitions, from magazine articles, from interviews, um, from group shows, solo shows, shops that sell my work, galleries that sell my work, um, and what have you. And it's just a little clip in silica. There's one there of when uh, the Tinmouth Post featured my new Muse painting. Obviously Muse are from Tinmouth, and I lived in Tinmouth for a while. And then it's just got, oh, come on, go back. Um, and then we just have various photographs of various exhibitions that I've done over the years. Feedback! Doo -doo 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 -doo. This, this is a lovely page. This is when someone sends me something really kind about the painting they've received. I um, post it on here. Um, obviously I don't post every one of them because it would be insane, but when I first started these are much shorter because they're from you know five years ago and they get longer so they're really nice what people say. So this one here from a Chris who says, well I returned from work early this morning to my enormous Christmas in July package. Upon opening and sir I can tell you it was the most amazing packing job I've ever experienced. I couldn't believe the quality of the work. A friend of mine was with me when it opened and he was absolutely stunned. Outstanding without the doubt the most favourite piece in the house. I couldn't be more happy. I stand before. I stated before. I will absolutely be t partaking in a follow-up commission painting from you. Your time, time, your timeliness, customer service, updates, and craftsmanship are truly a work of art. Pun intended. That's from Chris Audit, who's in the USA, and I haven't done a second painting from him yet. I hopefully, will do so. And he had commissioned a painting of his, his Mustang, which was very, very cool. Uh, there you go. You can see the size of it there. Um, so that has all, you know, all my feedback from all my customers. All really nice. Final page, the obligatory links page, of course, you just put your links in here. So these are just how to get me on all my social media. So Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, Tumblr, MySpace, and then these ones, LinkedIn. So please join me on Facebook. Please join me on Twitter and YouTube and Tumblr. Those are my most important ones. Um, you know how to do that. Just search or go here and click on the link. And then these are some of my friends who I help advertise. So we've got... Um, Essence of Serenity, Beauty Essentials, Pete Stacey Photography, The Big Barn, Art Store Gallery, Gecko Lodge, Joe Gilliam Trust. If you have some money and you want to just give it to a charity, give it to this one here, Joe, the Joe Gideon, Gilly, Gilliam Trust. Very, very good trust. So donate money there. That's the address. Uh, Grove Contemporary Art, yak, blah, 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 and get so on, so on, so on. 
so that is it that is my website i hope i've covered it all i hope you enjoyed it and i wasn't rambling too much there are hundreds and hundreds of paintings on my website so please just go along and have a look because um i can't show you every page it would get very very boring and tedious um if you want a painting drop me in a line via the contact form or email me at srquick at splinterstudios.com visit my website splinterstudios.com visit my facebook group and like me uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel, follow me on Twitter, and follow me on Tumblr. And I'm sure they'll, by the time I put this video up, there'll be another social media. So follow me, like me, do whatever to me on that group. Um, the website took me ages and ages and nearly killed me. So please, please go along and visit it. Watch the videos, buy some paintings. And if you see any spelling mistakes, let me know. Um, so my name's Stephen Quick. It's been an absolute pleasure showing you around my website. Um, I hope it was clean and presentable for you. So um, adios, goodbye, and see you around.